Many prominent tech ITOs in India, including OYO Hotels and logistic provider delivery, are pushing back their public debuts and preparing to reappraise their target valuations after several of India's high-profile startups stand soon after their listing. This could derail the boom in tech IPOs. 2021 was a monumental year for India as the country witnessed its first ever tech IPO rush. Leading the pack was 197 Communications Limited, Paytm's parent company, which raised a record $2.5 billion when it went public in November. But its shares have fallen 60% from its IPO price. Other tech companies like Zomato and Nika have also performed poorly in the stock market recently. Regulators have stepped up their scrutiny of IPO candidates after investors have gotten burned and this has contributed to delays. Delivery, which is backed by the Carlyle Group and SoftBank, for example, was looking to list by March this year, but it has pushed its nearly $1 billion IPO to the new fiscal year. The company is reviewing its listing plans after the stock market regulator frowned on the planned sale of a substantial amount of shares by the investors through the IPO, Bloomberg reported. OYO, which is backed by Sequoia Capital, Lightspeed Venture Partners and SoftBank among others, is facing regulatory questions too. OYO's ongoing litigation with Zostel Hospitality Private Limited and the fact it posted heavy losses after filing its primary IPO documents are some of the reasons for this delay. Bloomberg reported that the approval for OYO's draft prospectus has been pending for almost five months now and the company's management and bankers are not in a rush and the company is taking its time to respond to the regulator's queries. Bloomberg also reported that many investors and startups are keenly watching the Life Insurance Corporation of India IPO. LIC's final valuation and investor interest could dictate the course of the technology company's listing plans, the report added. The big question is this, will investors rise above the hype and look for profitability and returns? Only time will tell.